The Imagine program was a series of science, engineering, um, and math activities where the girls were able to explore different kinds of careers they would have. When we looked at the Imagine book, all, of it, all it was about, it was about girl scientists, girl scientists. I am an engineer with the General Services Administration. I come here about once a week to work with a group of 11th and 12th grade girls through the Imagine program. And we've been working through different, um, different projects and different aspects of science and math and engineering and technology, showing them the different aspects of, of that area of study um, and, and what it means in real, in real life and how it impacts how we work and, and live on a daily basis, um, and really showing them how fun it can be and what they can do with it. It's actually really fun with doing all these labs and stuff, looking at science in a different way, learning about product designing and, and like forensic scientists and like all them different fields. The girls in, in the high schools we go to and in the neighborhoods that we're in, they don't have the mentors. They don't have the mentors in their homes. They don't have the mentors in their neighborhoods. And a lot of times they don't have anybody to relate to in their schools as teachers that looks like them, that has come from where they've come from. They are desperately looking for those mentors to follow. Through STEM initiatives, these girls can learn about all the different types of careers they actually are capable of doing. They thought they weren't smart enough before, they thought they didn't have the training, but now they see they can do it. I am excited, I'm ecstatic that they had this opportunity for them to experience um, what it is to be a scientist, what it is to be an engineer. We'd be remiss not to give the, the Girl Scouts the opportunity to come in and work with our, our young ladies. A population uh, underrepresented in science, what better way to expose them than through uh, an organization that's, that's known historically for building character in young ladies. I would say if you were approached by the Girl Scouts to do this curriculum, take the chance, take the opportunity. It will change your students, their desire for learning, their motivation. Um, and there is not a single girl in this class that isn't excited about what they're doing. And that's something to say, because usually you have a few stragglers, and we don't. They're all on the same page. The experience of developing skills and interacting well with peers and, and taking on community-based projects um, allows young women to grow more confident, um, more secure in who they are. It allows them to develop the social skills they need to communicate well and to interact in a, in a positive way. I think it, for especially the ninth or 10th graders, it brings them out of their shells and, and it has them working with their peers. What I tell all of my students is that, you know, you might not remember this formula or this equation, you might not use it again ever in your life, but the skills that you will learn is how to be a leader, how to analyze, how to organize, how to think critically, how to problem solve. And I think, you know, doing an experiment or being involved in a program, I think all those opportunities build those types of skills. And I mean, I think these girls are very fortunate to be, to have this opportunity to do that.